Hello my friends, welcome to another mini message. Today we're going to be talking about Matthew 16, 13, 20, Peter's declarations about Jesus. When Jesus came to the region of Caesarea Philippi, he asked his disciples, who do people say that the Son of Man is? Well, they replied, some say John the Baptist, some say Elijah, and others say Jeremiah or one of the prophets. Then he asked them, but who do you say I am? Simon Peter answered, You are the Messiah, the Son of the living God. Jesus replied, You are blessed, Simon, son of John, because my Father in heaven has revealed this to you. You did not learn this from any human being. Now I say to you that you are Peter, which means rock, and upon this rock I will build my church, and all the powers of hell will not conquer it. And I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you forbid on earth will be forbidden in heaven, and whatever you permit on earth will be permitted in heaven. Then he sternly warned the disciples not to tell anyone that he was the Messiah. Wow, powerful, right? Well, God's telling us here, like, um, that they, they asked, you know, who, who he was in that time. And they, they believed that he was sent by, by God, right? So in, uh, Jesus is telling him that the Simon, you know, Peter, he was blessed, right? Because uh, he says, uh, well, he was telling to, to Jesus... It was revealed not by men. It was revealed by God. So how God reveals um, himself to us? Through his word, through our Lord Jesus Christ, right? So how, how we come to faith when we come to the word of God, right? So the, the disciples in that time, they had Jesus. They had the word of God in front of them, right? They were learning from the word of God, the living word of God, which is our Lord Jesus Christ. Now we have the Bible, and we believe reading the word of God, right? And no man is telling us, it's ourselves coming to Jesus, reading from him, and God himself through his spirit is revealing himself to us. And he's telling, can you repeat number 17? Yes. Jesus replied, you are blessed, Simon, son of John, because my Father in heaven has revealed this to you. You did not learn this from any human being. Right? And then he went to say that, uh, that he was a rock, over that, that he was revealing that he had that faith. Over that faith, he's going to be his church. So we have to have that faith. Right? So... The church is gonna be built in that in our faith, right? And uh, the you know the all evil is not gonna prevail against our faith, right? And he uh, can you repeat number nineteen? And I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you forbid on earth will be forbidden in heaven, and whatever you permit on earth will be permitted in heaven. Yes, in other parts of the Bible says that the doors are open in heaven, right? For us, right? Because we, as believers, we just pray and God will provide. Right? And we're going to know how to pray because the Holy Spirit that lives in us is asking for, from us. We're going to be praying according to His will. So heaven is going to be open. Right? Whatever we, whoever we bless, is gonna, they're going to be blessed. Whoever we, any evil we cast or we, we tie, is going to be tied. Right? So that's, that's our faith. Right? That's what God's telling us. Jesus is telling us Himself here that. Right? So we believe in that. And we follow in our faith. I guess it's be like a, that rock that He's talking about. Right? You want to something? Yeah. Uh, I love the verse 17 about uh, when Jesus is telling Peter that his father is the one that has revealed this truth to him, revealed mm -hmm. Jesus to mm -hmm. him. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, as I think any person in ministry or any kind of church leadership mm -hmm. understands the, um, the necessity to be humble mm -hmm. and to really understand that it is not in our power that people understand or get Jesus. Mm -hmm. It is literally God himself who does the work through mm -hmm. the Holy Spirit preparing people's hearts and calling them out of the darkness. And mm -hmm. then even that miracle when people do come from darkness to the light, that is all God, mm -hmm. all glory mm -hmm. to God. Mm -hmm. That is we just get to be a part of things, mm -hmm. uh, you know, all of us do, really, whether mm -hmm. we're in doing it on a, a video or in a church setting or even just talking to a neighbor or a family member. All of us believers are called to the same ministry mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. share Jesus, the gospel of Jesus Christ. And so it is just humbling when you really stop and think about that he uses us mm -hmm. to be a part of what he is doing. Mm -hmm. He's working through us through the Holy Spirit for, for Jesus to be revealed to each individual. What a blessing, a privilege, and honor. Amen. God bless you guys. Bye. Bye.